Yo, what's going on guys? So Mega Titan here yet again with more division videos and for this video I want to show you real quick the gear and the weapons and talents that I used in completing the Pure Sky Challenge mission. And so yeah, for the <clears throat> for the mission I actually ended up using the support station and uh that's just me because like there was someone running pulse or someone else running a uh, smart cover so i just went for support station for you know additional uh, heals and yeah i actually didn't use that much of this like i could have just easily used pulse and it would be better but yeah i just used that um for my heal i just use booster shot because i have the vigorous chest piece I actually ran this whole build without combat medic. Instead of combat medic, I used on the move, because combat medic, when you pop your, your med kit, it can uh, destroy any nearby uh, smart covers. So yeah, let's move on to my gear. I have a uh, vigorous chest, which grants you overheal on your uh, on your uh, heal, <coughs> on all your heal skills basically so the reason why I didn't go with the striker or the sentry chest then using a savage gloves is because savage gloves only gives you critical chance and critical chance might be good because it's you know it's a passive critical chance but you have to remember that booster shot not only gives you 15% base damage which boosts all your damage across the board also boosts your crit it also gives you all damage resilience so as you can see that's zero right and i'll show you my damage right now 20.8 then 78 crits 33 and 89.8 that's a significant boost along with the 15 percent all damage resilience plus the overheal so basically yeah i ran this with the uh, crit damage i ran this with the uh, skill power and i ran the mask with skill power skill power is a must because i d i don't think that putting armor or putting uh, crit damage here is well worth the 6000 to 6700 skill power that you get i also don't think that another slot over four to five thousand skill power is uh, worth it so yeah that's that gloves holster that's basically it um weapons as far as weapons are concerned i just ran with uh, this uh, ak that i have for my primary as you can see i have a 182 mp7 as you and the reason why is because this has responsive and brutal um, and i uh, <clears throat> did a bit of testing compared to my 204 mp7 which only has responsive this weapon still uh, outbursts that other weapon so yeah I just went with this weapon until I get a 204 one with the responsive and brutal or responsive and deadly and brutal hopefully but yeah so yeah that's it for the video guys I hope you enjoyed um, if you did please leave a like let me know what you guys think about this build and I'll see you guys in the next one peace